Hello, this is a brief demo on how to create a newsletter using the ShareASale affiliate network. So you're going to go in here and you're going to select affiliate and you're going to do send newsletter. Uh, here you have the option of a new blank text letter which would look like a regular email or a new blank HTML newsletter and even a new split campaign. We're going to focus on just the new blank HTML newsletter for this one. It defaults to compose, but I always go to recipient because this is something you don't want to mess up on, so I always make it the first one. Here you can send targeted campaigns by selecting the um, specific group. So for instance, if you wanted to do um, paleo and you only wanted to do a paleo affiliates, you would click view all affiliates and you could overwrite in this case. Now I actually want to send this first email out to everybody, which is what it defaults to, so I'm going to leave this be. Um, but you can see in the previous results that you also have the option of sending to individuals. Um, you could do another search here. Uh, you can do it based on a multiple of things, like only ones that are approved for FTP, so only ones you know who have a, um, a data feed, or even just, like I said, the individuals. You can just grab the individuals from there. All right, I went and created the newsletter already, so it would be easy to copy and paste. Just make sure when you do the email subject line, it's like any email, you want to make sure that it's engaging. I like conversational emails. So here I can use the macros and I can put in, it says first name. It will, I promise you, show up as their first name. So you don't have to worry about that. Um, in here, you'll see that I reference a coupon code. So in order to add the coupon code, you right now have it all in the deal database. So you go to Get Deals, and we want to grab that 10% offer. I like to select, select the um, Get Link Code Display. This will make it so they can literally just copy and paste it. I'm putting it in paragraph format so that it has nice spacing around it. If you want to add links or banners, um, you would do the same thing, but you would just grab it from this, Get Banners. And you can see here, you can search by categories, um, and then you still click on this button, and you can either do Get Link or Get Code Display. Um, I reminded them about our great commission structure, and then always put in a call to action, then if they want to reach out to me, they can. When I click on preview, I get to see exactly what it's going to look like when they see it. So right here, I can see that my links are working great, spacing looks good, everything looks good to me. It's a plain newsletter, but for me, this is what I find converts the best. Finalize is where you want it to send. So you'll see here that you have the option of making it public. The only time you do not want to make it public or not included in the RSS feed is if it's an exclusive deal for a specific group or an individual affiliate. So here you can choose your from and reply, as well as your name. I'm going to go with the company name. And this is a great tool, so you can actually schedule it anytime, um, schedule it out to send. So typically, I like to send out newsletters Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. I personally like the morning versus the pre-dawn. I'm going to select this as a template because I know that you want to use this as a template. And then I click finalize and you are good to go. I hope you found this tutorial easy and useful, and don't forget to call me if you have any questions.